Hi guys, it's Sunday. We're gonna be doing a Sunday reset. I had a fabulous morning as I took you guys along and I just took an everything shower. I just did all my teeth brushing and flossing and mouth washing and it's a total Sunday reset and I'm really happy about it. Um, I'm gonna talk about it more on the podcast. So go listen as this video comes out. Our podcast is also coming out this week's episode, Gals on the Go, go listen. Um, I literally had a bird poop in my hair today and I also had a poop related incident yesterday. Not my personal poop, but just like it's been a poopy weekend. That's disgusting to start this video, but like it's just been a weekend and it's just starting to get funny. So I've been having to take these intense showers. But yeah, I like, oh, ugh. Anyways, so more the merrier of wanting to just clean Sunday reset. Um, yeah, I just showered, like I said, and I'm and I've been washing my sheets on Sunday, which has been a really lovely ritual, so we're gonna do that. But yeah, there's not much else to say. I had a really nice morning breakfast, went for a really long walk, then I got in the treadmill. I have a cardio journey I'm working on right now. I'm trying to get in two and a half hours of cardio a week. We're gonna see if I'm gonna be able to do that. I'm trying to get into this zone two in specific with my heart rate. And you guys know I get like triggered by talking about heart rate with anxiety, panic attacks, stuff like that. But I'm really working through it, and I'm really proud of myself. I did 40 minutes on the treadmill today at a speed of 3 or 3.5, I can't remember, and then 8.5 incline. I'm like working my way up to 12, but honestly, I'm kind of vibing with the 8.5, so I'm happy with it. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really proud of myself because that's sometimes a little bit of a challenge for me, and I also did it on Friday. So I'm going to try and just infuse it more in my routine, just like a light cardio, like the uphill walking is my vibe, just walking in general since it's heated up in New York City, I'm just walking everywhere, like my feet are actually hurting because I just walked all morning, like Ryan and I got breakfast at 9am and then I've, it's 2pm and I've been walking all day, I just got back. So yeah, um, but we're just going to get started with the Sunday reset, I just ordered myself a spinach wrap from Lenwich, it's been my favorite meal, and yeah, subscribe if you guys are new here. a half of that wrap and it was I'm gonna try and time it where I ate the second half of that wrap right before I'm actually going to Hannah Burner's comedy show tonight she invited Brooke and I um, to see her show which I'm so excited we love comedy and I haven't met her yet Brooke's been on her podcast and met her but I haven't met her yet so it was really nice of her to give us tickets um, so I'm gonna time it right where I eat that right before because they're really filling because I put turkey lettuce tomato provolone cheese and um, avocado in it so that was good Health Aid just came out with canned kombucha, ASMR, and I'm really here for it. I love the glass bottles, I do, but I can fit more of these in my fridge at a time. And they're a little smaller, so if you don't, like, you finish it, you know, at a decent time when it's still cold. This one is passion fruit and tangerine. I really like the flavors that the canned ones are in, so let's try those. Oh my god, that is so good. I want to, like, make an alcoholic drink with this at one point. Like that? That's really good. If you like kombucha, this is a very delicious flavor. Another thing I like to do on Sundays, or whenever I remember, remember really, but I take so many screenshots, like if I'm outfit planning or for thumbnails, I'm sure a lot of you guys also do the same. I like to do a big ol' one of these. Oh, let me make sure the volume's on. Okay. And just clear out my desktop. Like, that's just sexy. Also, my friend Katie Bellotti has a Patreon. She designs um, wallpapers each month for your phone and computer, and I think iPad too, and I love April so much. I've got my sheets going right now, and I have like all of this laundry I wanna do, and I realized I ordered more detergent, and it's not in the mail yet. I ordered more glamorous wash, and I don't think I have. Yeah, these are, I don't think that's detergent. So I may need to run and get some because I need to do a lot more laundry and honestly it was the bare minimum that I had in there which 
I probably should have just waited, but I'm very impatient. So let's hope it cleans well. Because then I also want to, I'm like washing my bath mat once a week, I feel, but it feels good. I want to wash my bath mat and like my towel that I leave on my sink just to like wash my hands and stuff. Kept my apartment quite clean this week, but then I just like the last two days, I've really let it go in my little Hannah Montana closet situation. I think this will be easily fixed. I just need to put everything away. So we're going to do that now. If you guys didn't know, oh wait, there's even more <laughs> shoes in here. This is where I keep most of my athletic sneakers. And then here I have sandals and other high heels. Um, I've acquired some more cowboy boots because I'm going to stagecoach. These are from Bellini. Yeah, Bellini. I really like these. And then these are either Bellini or Matisse. No, they're also Bellini, which are so fun. So I'm very excited about that. But I need somewhere to put them. <laughs> and then back there I have like snowshoes and other shoes I don't wear as often. And then I don't know if you guys have ever noticed, but I actually have more like fun dressy heels up there as well. And this has been such an amazing purchase for me. It was literally from Amazon. I think I just looked up like sunglasses rack, but I wanted one that would go on the wall so it didn't take up any like uh, shelf space. And this is perfect. I have like all my black sunglasses for the most part up here. And then... I don't know, browns and greens tones. I don't know if that makes sense, but I, this, I'm really happy with this. And then Slip actually sent me some more hair ties because these are literally my favorite hair ties ever. They don't create creases in my hair. I'll literally get a blowout and go to sleep with the big ones in my hair and my hair looks amazing the next morning. So I, I'm really happy to have more of the blonde ones in particular. Um, and this is just my everyday makeup. I guess last time I was doing my makeup, I was a little a bit in a bit of a rush. Um, and then these are some rare beauty products that I have. So, yeah, we're just gonna fix all this. Cleaned up my glam room, whatever you want to call it. This Amazon hard-boiled egg maker has just changed my life. So you just put a little water up to what it says, because it says like, you could do hard-boiled, soft-boiled, medium-boiled, you could do poached eggs, which I haven't done yet, but I want to try, because I love a poached egg. Put that on top, get your eggs. Hallelujah. And I'm probably gonna do as many as I can here. Key is, they tell you there's this like spiky thing on this side. And you just get a little air hole in the egg. Which I think is so interesting. And I can't believe it doesn't break when I do this. The first time I did it, I was so scared. But yeah, I've been really enjoying having hard boiled eggs and maybe like a spoon or two of cottage cheese before a workout or just like in the morning when I'm in a rush. It's really nice because I just, you guys know I love an egg. I love an egg for breakfast. And this has been an unlock for me. So it was, it felt so wasteful to buy pre-made hard boiled eggs, which I'm not above, but you know, I was like, let me just use this. So then you just plug it in. And I just keep it going until it starts singing a song and it's done. And then I immediately put, like, it's so cute! And they just start boiling, or hard boiling. Um, and then I immediately put them in an ice bath. And then after like 20 minutes, I peel them after the ice bath. The ice bath, I think, helps them be more peelable, if I remember correctly. So, yeah, I'm just gonna wait till I hear the little sound, but.
went ahead and used Getter and I just got some laundry detergent to hold me over because I'm in a washing mood and then I got more toilet paper. So we're gonna do some more loads of laundry now and I just put the eggs in their bath. <laughs> so good like I got so much done I've been cycling out laundry I just did my makeup while I was on the phone with my best friend Caitlin we were chat chat chatting and then I was like wait I have to go um so I just told you my lips but for Hannah's show tonight I'm so excited um it's like actually I should just look at the weather but I've kind of decided this is what I'm wearing because it's like always cold in a theater yeah it's 62 this was good for 60s. Um, I have this Skims bra on, and then I, oh, it's buttoned. I just got this blazer from Bronx and Banco. I mean, come on, I love, I love some shoulder pads, and then my go-to Good American baggy jeans. These hoops from Jared Jewelry. I think this is my fit, and I think I might wear sneakers, because it's like a comedy show, you know? We don't need to wear heels. But, I mean, she's going to be hopefully wearing heels and, like, not hopefully, but, like, she should be dressed up however she wants to be. Um, yeah, I think this is a vibe. I think. Yeah, I'm digging it. This is good. This is very good. I'm going to try this Maybelline lip liner in the color Beige Babe. Never used it before. Okay, it's a little lighter than I thought. It's a lot lighter than I thought, so whatever. I wanted to try it out. And then this is Pat McGrath lip gloss in the color Flesh Fantasy. I am obsessed. This is like my fourth bottle, tube of this. And I really, really like the color a lot. I'm kind of hot, but it's also, as we know, my AC isn't turned on in my building yet because I live in an older building. So I'm just a little toasty, but I think I'll be happy outside bag I'll do my Bottega Jody that'll just kind of match this shoes I'm gonna text Brooke and ask her if she's wearing sneakers or heels she's probably wearing boots Brooke hasn't responded but I'm gonna do the sneakers I want to be comfy okay about to head out the door I hope I don't hate my fit as soon as I leave my apartment perfume tonight we're going Baccarat Rouge yay all right let's go to the show and I'll see you guys soon Hey Brooke. Are you ready? So ready. We're excited. We're in the green room. We just said hello to Hannah. She's doing meet and greets. She's so nice, so cute. She was so like ready for the meet and greets. And the lighting in here is amazing. I know. I'm really a big fan of this. The show was outstanding. We had so much fun. We said hi to Hannah briefly after before she went to her meet and greet, and she was just so nice and amazing. I was like, I can't believe I'm meeting you. She was being so nice. We we're like trying to talk about her show, and she's like, Your outfit's in Cabo. I was like, 
no, 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 your show. Like, guys, I, I've only seen her stuff on like TikTok, and I've listened to her podcast before. She's funny. She's got some really great bits. Very relatable, especially as women. Oh my god, she's so good. She's so she just owns the stage. She's so quick. Brooke and I were just like cackling the whole time. So and I we met some of you guys. So thanks for saying hi. Um, I hate that moment when you come back and you're like, I have to make my bed when you wash the sheets, you know. So that's what I'm working through, you know, right now. Um, I think I'm gonna. I want to make hot tea, but I forgot how hot my apartment is. <sighs> I'm gonna complain about it. I'm sorry. It's annoying. Um, I'm gonna open the door again a little bit. Get some fresh cold air. In. Let's start the Sunday reset night edition. Just made my bed. Why is making your bed cardio? Like it literally got my heart rate up. I'm like, whoo! That was a workout. Now it's like, do I get in bed or, you know, this is fresh from the dryer. I should fold this now. I feel like I should just see it through because then it's going to be wrinkly tomorrow and then these wet clothes are going to be sitting here. Like this just needs to happen. So I'm going to fold. Ugh. It's Sunday reset. That's what we're doing. There was a large stack of laundry here. No more. That didn't take me too long. I just listened to a silly podcast bringing in some fresh air just to stay cool. Got a Georgia t-shirt on, wash my face, you know the drill. Winding down for the night, I just planned all my workouts for the week. I like to do that on Sundays so I know what I'm getting myself into. And yeah, we have a good week ahead. This was a great Sunday reset. I'm just letting my, I, I washed my bathing suit because I wore it the other day. My friend Katie and I went and like tanned at West Side Highway, which is amazing. So I washed my bathing suit, but I'm just letting it air dry because I feel like that makes sense. Got the last load going. My my bath mat is drying. Gonna brush my teeth and go to bed. I love you guys endlessly, and I will see you guys next time for my next video. Bye!